Okay, so the next presentation is about the Tradeo bug bounty by Alex Todorov. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, first of all, is there anyone who doesn't understand Bulgarian here? Okay, okay, I'll, I'll continue in English. Uh, so I'm here today to present uh, uh, this thing, and that thing doesn't work. So that's me. The most important thing you need to know is uh, I work with Linux and I file books. That's what I do all day. I'm QA. And uh, this is my daughter. As you can see, she also works with Linux and she already has filed a few bugs. And today we are here to talk to you about uh, bugs that uh, cause security issues and, and problems. And uh, the first thing I want to start is, uh, uh, that's a little bit old, but kind of favorite of mine. Uh, as you can see, you can send this uh, XML to a Rails server and it contains a YAML field. And what you can do with it is actually you can execute arbitrary code on the server with the YAML uh, shown in YAML. So that's a problem. Whenever you, at that time when you had a Rails server on the internet, that anybody could send you this XML with YAML inside and the YAML parser will, will happily execute everything you, you send it. So the Rails guys fix it and a little bit later, they had the same problem at a different place. So now you have a JSON parser, which actually isn't JSON, it's again YAML. So you send it this YAML content and you can arbitrarily execute any code as well. So the guys fix it and then you have this, which is active record and you can serialize anything, including YAML. So an attacker can, can send you a YAML text, it gets serialized on the server, and guess what? You can also execute arbitrary code through the same vulnerability. So, ouch. Um, why I'm talking about Rails in particular? Because Tradio, uh, the company I work for, um, works with Rails. We have a large Ruby on Rails application, and we take security very seriously. Uh, we are not some uh, newly founded startup. We are actually a financial institution which uh, does trading and has a certificate for a trading broker. And we take security very seriously. Uh, according to some statistics, uh, the money that goes through the platform uh, is uh, in the range of the top 20 banks in the country. So we really take security very seriously. That's why I am announcing today the Tradio Security Bug Bounty Program. Uh, if you are a security researcher or you want to spend some time hacking and improve your hacking skills, you can go to this website to bounty.radio.com and uh, uh, see what the condition of the programs are, which uh, properties are eligible for bounties and which are not. And then you can try and hack our website. Uh, you can submit uh, security issues to us. The monetary price ranges from as low as uh, 250 Bulgarian leva up to 5,000 for a single uh, issue reported, if we find it to be eligible. Uh, also, if you have no experience with uh, security or penetration testing, tomorrow starts with a very nice session which is called Penetration Testing for Dummies. So you go to this session, listen what penetration testing is, then go back to bountytradio.com and start hacking. Thank you. <laughs> 